can I speak to Krista? Hi, Krista, this is Sherry at the school board meeting calling. You've requested to speak during the agenda item 1J. We are now to that item. You will have three minutes to speak. Please state your name for the record and then you may begin speaking. Okay. You can start. My name is Krista Koch. Thank you, school board trustees and administrators. I've been researching the HART curriculum and I'm disturbed by what I found. I urge you to kindly reject it. At a recent candidate forum hosted by student journalists, Mrs. Everett stated that an example of a homework assignment would be to ask your parents when they became sexually active and how they made that decision. I'm appalled by the thought of anyone being forced by way of a homework assignment to ask or be asked about their sexual experiences. Would foster kids be expected to ask these questions of their foster parents? Kids being abused by their parents? Many people have had negative first experiences with sexual activity. Have you considered how being asked these questions by their child may re-traumatize these parents? I assure you it would be worse than reading a rape passage in a work of fiction. The second part of the question assumes that everyone makes a conscious decision when to become sexually active, which is false. The curriculum is full of fear-mongering and shame. Shame for being sexually active before the age the authors deem appropriate, shame for abortion, shame for gay sex, and shame for an individual's decision not to marry. According to the authors, quote, studies show marriage is the best protection against poverty, even better than a college education. Marriage, once practiced by all income classes, is becoming a lost dream for many poor women, end quote. It is my hope that CBUSD re rejects the notion of teaching female students to prioritize finding a husband over getting a college education. Fear and shame are also front and center in this passage that the heart creators deem an essential part of the curriculum. Quote, a youth boiling with hormones will wonder why he should not give full freedom to his sexual desires. And if he is unchecked by custom, morals, or laws, he may ruin his life before he matures sufficiently to understand that sex is a river of fire that must be banked and cooled by a hundred restraints if it is not to consume in chaos both the individual and the group. Durant, in Durant, 1968, end quote. I will leave you with the denial of liability disclaimer from the creators. Quote, denial of liability. None of the information provided in this curriculum should be considered medical advice and no liability is accepted. This curriculum is not intended to be complete or comprehensive in scope, end quote. If the creators of the HART curriculum refuse to accept liability for its content, why would any school district choose to adopt it? Thank you. Thank you.